Hi, this is Dr. Vidya Patil. I'm an obstetrician and a gynecologist, a laparoscopic surgeon and an infertility specialist. Uh, today, the topic we are discussing is infertility uh, treatment prior to IVF in females. So, there are uh, women who are infertile and they do not conceive in the first year of marriage. Uh, even if they, even when they have had a regular intercourse for a year, need treatment. A simple infection of the cervix like a cervicitis or a vaginal infection can cause infertility and a routine uh, examination by a gynecologist can treat these problems. The uterine problems also are very common uh, these days and they include uterine polyps which can be easily removed using a hysteroscope, a uterine uh, septa which can cause abortions, uh, these can be operated easily uh, by a uh, hysteroscopic uh, resection of the septum. Uh, small fibroids can cause problems and early abortions which can be removed using a hysteroscope. There can be problems with the fallopian tube and those include pelvic infections which can cause tubal blocks. Using a hysteroscope, we can do tubal recanalization procedures. The distal tubal blocks which, which are caused by uh, infections can be easily treated uh, by uh, fibrioplasty procedures done laparoscopically. Uh, the ovarian problems like ovarian tumors can be tackled before uh, you know going ahead with IVF or IUIs or natural conception because ovarian tumors can interfere with a normal functioning of the female genitourinary system. Infections of the pelvic organs like internal infections called pelvic inflammatory disease or endometriosis which cause adhesions like there are things which have stuck inside the abdomen which require removal and restoration of normal anatomy can be done laparoscopically very successfully and many patients have remained pregnant just by these procedures. Uh, if these people are not conceiving besides all these operative work then we go ahead and we do help them out uh, doing a intrauterine insemination where the husband's semen is washed outside and the best of sperms are picked up and instilled within the uterine cavity when the follicle is ripe and ready. Uh, if these procedures say in a young uh, couple where 7-8 IUIs have failed then this couple requires to undergo an IVF procedure. Now IVF procedures are done where uh, the eggs are retrieved outside and the embryos are formed outside you can also they are also known as test tube babies uh, you know and then the embryo formed outside is instilled inside the uterine cavity and helps helping in conception many a times there are fibroids which are not uncommon they are uh, uterine tumors and they are generally benign benign means non cancerous and if they are growing more than 5 centimeters in size they warrant removal but in infertility patients who are uh, where the uh, uterine fibroids are even as small as 2.5 centimeters warrant removal in case that is a cause of infertility. All these procedures are done conservatively without any operative big uh, incisions on the tummy and the patient can go home in a day or two. So friends I hope you found this information uh, informative and for further enquiries you can always contact me at Arya Women's Hospital. I am Dr. Vidya Patil and you can contact me through library.com. Thank you.